Okay, my lovelies. Oops, sorry. Hola, chicas y chicos. And welcome back to my channel. Y bienvenido para atrás a mi canal. Well, today I'm coming to you because I have a small little haul that I would like to show you guys. Um, I just been accumulating hauls. I do have a couple of videos that I have to upload and do, but I just didn't want to leave you guys in the dark on everything that I'm doing because I am working. So it does take a lot of my time, but I won't leave you guys for good without anything, okay? So let's just get this started, all right? Well, I ordered from Born Pretty Store, okay? Um, here we go. For all of these from Born Pretty Store. I'm sorry, that's my baby's little <laughs> bulb like clipper right here that she plays around with. But um, yes, I ordered all of these from Born Pretty Store. This is gonna be um, semi two to three little holes in one. Hopefully I can fit it all. If not, then so be it. But this is from Born Pretty Store. These are um, supposed to be the uh, holographic chameleon as well as um, chrome pigments. To be honest with you, I did do swatches on these and um, I'm only happy with probably like two out of all eight of these because um, they they reflect more as a pearl essence on a nail or um, one of the mermaid effect shimmers as well but these were supposed to all be chrome and metallic or chameleon chrome type thing and no it's not so let me just show you the swatches for these this is the one um, that I was okay with, that I pretty much like uh, how it came out because it does have that chame the chameleon effect from purple to green to teal and that came out pretty cute. I like it. Um, I don't know. You guys let me know. That's one of them. Okay, this is number one. Um, then also, I have this one and as you can see, it looks more like a pearl lesson instead of a chrome. And these are all gel polishes that I'm using, as well as the top coat is a gel, and it's a non-tacky gel, and then I put high gloss top coat to give it that extra shine, but it's still not in the chrome effect. I don't know if you guys can see that, it's showing more as a pearlescent. Um, as well as this one, it didn't even reflect as much to it at all it just gave it that little pearl look um, with a little bit of goldish shimmer to it and that's why I said it looks like um, the mermaid shimmer effect and that's this one all right then I have with this gel it's a baby blue gel and it also did the same thing and it gave it more of that pearlescent look instead of the chrome look all right um I did like this one but I do love purple um, fortunately it didn't give it the chrome effect that it was supposed to um, but it did give it the mermaid effect look okay as you can see the shimmers going all through it and that's it and that was that one but it still came out very pretty I do like it I like this one and the first one um, I mean it, the pearlescent look it looks all right now this I did on two different shades I did this one on the dark purple which is like the plump purple and I did use the um, gold chrome supposedly <laughs> and um, I like how it came out it gave it that little chrome effect and it came out pretty cute you know it did it came out pretty cute I liked it so that's three out of eight. And then I did it on black, okay? I put the gold on the black and I gave it like that um, greenish tint to it in a chrome. It does look cute, I like it. Um, it doesn't give the full effect as how it was supposed to, but I, I like it, I liked how it came out. So the gold, I like the gold and I like the number one which is the comedian okay and 
the purple as well as how the gold came out on the um, plum purple gel so yeah those are my swatches for that for the born pretty and um, so I basically like out of eight of them because I did this three six seven there's one missing because I didn't like how it came out at all I just got frustrated and just selected but there's seven out of eight and throughout the whole eight all I did like was one two three four well one two and three um, <clears throat> out of eight so you know technically I'm happy with that but then again I'm not so that's my opinion on the born pretty um, packages and I be honest I'm not gonna lie and say oh yeah they're fantastic when truth is being told and viewed okay so yeah I like three out of eight okay so that's my born pretty swatches that's from born pretty that I like and that's my born pretty <laughs> um, pigments all right and now I did order this mermaid effect glitter um i did all of this off of aliexpress i did love how this came out look at this this is my swatch to this one and it came out absolutely gorgeous you see that absolutely gorgeous i love the effect to it and all and that's that one for that one okay um i also did order from color craze 2000 I did order her chrome powder as well let's see um, I think my oh the light is reflecting off of you guys I'm sorry I did also order the hollow powder okay which they're both beautiful I love them both um, let's see if this shows it better there you go all right um the color craze 2000 the silver chrome as well as hollow powder okay now <coughs> excuse me this is gonna be my review for the color craze and let me zoom in a little bit for you guys all right um for the chrome for the chrome effect okay this is how it looks I did do it under a uh, plum purple so I'm trying to do a set with plum purple but this is the reflection that it did give me okay it came out pretty it came out pretty well okay I like it um, I'm probably gonna try something else to see because this was just full with gel but I'm gonna show you something right now this is the chrome full with gel but I did the hollow okay and when I did the hollow I first did it with gel only okay and it came out matte it didn't look right um, as you can see there's no holographic to it at all but I went ahead and I did it in um, gel at the bottom and then I did the no white gel just to oh my bad just to um, put the pigment on and then what I did with this one, as you can see, I don't know if this is even giving you the justice that it needs, but I did top coat it with just polish, okay? I top coated, I top coated it with high gloss polish, okay? And it gave it extremely, the holographic effect that I was looking for. I love it. I loved how this one came out compared to this one, okay? This one came out looking matte, milky, and this one came out with just a regular top coat um, with high gloss, the full dimension of the holographic powder pigment, okay? And it came out absolutely phenomenal. I loved it, okay? So that's my little review on Color Craze 1000. So what I did with this one to have that effect, I think I'm just going to go ahead and do that with this one. To see if all I need is just a no ma um, no white gel for just to put the um, pigments on and level it out properly, cure it, and then just top coat it with um, high gloss polish. Okay, 
top coat. And I'll show you that if you guys want how the effect came out. If it came out better like this one or if it came out the same way as this one. Okay, so that's my review for the Color Craze 2000. Okay, and those are the Chrome Powder Pigment in Silver as well as the Hollow Powder. Okay, so yep, that's my review for that. Um, it doesn't come much in the bottles, and born pretty, um, the bottles do come full to the top, but in Color Craze, I'll show you right now. I just use just that on my brush well on my little sponge and this is how it came you see how little it's in there yeah but yeah one thing is a little does go a very long way because I just use my sponge on the top and I'll take it and it covers the whole the whole tip or the whole nail and then as well as for the color craze hollow powder it came up a little more than what the chrome powder did but I like I said I used the top of it and it does cover the whole entire nail now I'll show you real quick one of the full um, and pretty for um, chrome quote-unquote um, powders and for me it's glitters to be honest with you and this is how full it came. Um, it does have a little more than what Color Craze sent on the chrome, but like I said, I do use the top of it and it does cover the whole nail um, with my little sponge. And it's just a little makeup sponge, guys. I mean, I think it does justice and does better than those little brushes that we get, which are these. Because even though we put it onto the nail and we'll rub it onto the nail, I think the little sponge will give you the depth that you need and you could go a little harder with the sponge without taking anything off, depending on how you're doing it. Um, but yeah, they do come full. I understand these are little jars compared to these, as you can see. But if you look at the depth to the jar, to the top, it's still the depth to here, to here as well. Okay, it's still the same thing and this one comes all to like down here and this one comes all the way up so yeah so that's my review on born pretty as well as color craze and that's my haul for you guys on that so on that note I hope you like what I'm showing you and if you have any opinions or any you know questions please comment below let me know and on that note I love you guys, and I'm going to send you guys over with a bunch, a bunch of kisses. Mwah, mwah, and God bless you. Watch over you now and always, now and always, okay? And if you guys like, please don't forget, like, subscribe, comment below, and what? Share. Sharing is always caring. You already know. So that's the end of this little haul video that I wanted to show you slash review. Um, I do have another one coming up from some alloys that I did purchase. I just don't want... To make this video too long it's already almost 16 minutes in but you know when you do knickknacks on a video we could bring the timing a little downer but um yeah that's my review slash my little haul and my opinion towards each product that i just showed you so yeah that's it guys thanks so much for watching i love you guys so much and you guys are the only reason why my channel is still up because the inspiration that you give me and the loving words that you always comment always give me the strength to continue to bring you little things like this and my thoughts on things or just my little nails or my mixes <laughs> but anyway guys thanks so much for watching i love yous and don't forget share sharing is always caring you already know so i catch you guys on my next video thanks for watching love yous bye